Okay, pupils, we are on this year five English plus one book book, book on page six. We are on starter unit. So this is on vocabulary and we will learn prepositions and everyday objects. Activity one, find 12 more words in the word search. So already given, number one, pen. So already strike two. Then you need to find another 12. So we'll start with this uh, speaker. So speaker is around here. So maybe I maximize it a bit. So speaker somewhere around here. And then we have a uh, desk. And then we have shelf and then we have back here mobile phone so this one we have spacing here so in word search you ignore the spacing so mobile phone And then we have poster, mobile phone, poster, and then we have table, so table, and then we have drawer. Drawer. Then we have clock. Clock. And then we have coat. And then we have notebook. And then lastly, we have laptop. So next, we move on to activity two. Activity two, correct the sentences. So we have the first one, it's a laptop. It isn't a laptop, it's a dictionary or book. And then number two, it's a notebook. So you write it as it's isn't. A notebook. It's a pen and next number two it's a dictionary so it's it isn't a dictionary So it's a bag. And number three, it's a coat. So it it isn't a coat. So it's a book. And then number four, it's a pen.
it isn't a pen it's a laptop so not not lab lap laptop and number five it's a bag it isn't a bag it's a coat okay next we go to activity three so activity three look at the pictures complete the sentences with the prepositions so we have between in on near next to opposite under so you may also refer to your students book for this uh, english plus one students book so you may read you might remember the the frog pictures so on explaining the prepositions so visually you can uh, interpret how the preposition is going to be used so I will maximize it a bit so the coat is near the notebook so this is it so the notebook is near the coat is near the notebook and then let's take a look at number one the clock is the shelf so the clock so obviously this is on so you choose on so this is on and then number two the back is the chair so the back number two so maybe I minimize it a bit so that you can see the picture as well as the word so so the back is under the chair the back is under the chair number three the dictionary the drawer so dictionary so this is in in the drawer and number four the test so the test is the table so number four this is opposite and then we have number five the mobile phone is so mobile phone is between the laptop and the speaker so this one is a speaker so maybe printed very black you cannot see it so this is laptop and this is speaker so the mobile phone is between the laptop and the speaker and then number six the poster so this is the poster is the board so this is next to okay we cross all here and next we go to activity 4 activity 4 write sentences about a picture use prepositions so we use uh, each line each new line we write a sentence so the laptop is on the desk so the laptop is on the desk and then we have uh, this notebook so maybe I explain a bit so I maximize the picture so this is a notebook this is a speaker so this is a dictionary so this is a clock so drawer and then we have coat here and then we have back here and then we have mobile phone so this is a chair 
and then this is a poster this is a board okay so because all printed very black so you might not see clearly so I minimize it a bit so that you can see the sentences so the laptop is on the desk and then we need to talk about a not notebook the notebook is between the dictionary and a speaker and then next a new line so we talk about a poster the poster is on the wall and then next we talk about a pen the pen is near the laptop And next, the clock. The clock is in the drawer. And then next, we talk about the bag. The bag is under the table. And then we talk about the coat. The coat is on the table. And then lastly, we talk about the mobile phone. The mobile phone is next to the coat. So basically we talked a lot about these objects already so that's it for this page we are on page six of this year five english plus one book book so if you are okay you can subscribe here and then you can watch the related contents here and then right below this video there's a link you can click it you can join my Dragon robot for free